Terra go? To your left. Terra! <laughs> Press X to Terra. Terra! No, this isn't David Cage. David! Terra! I hate that man. I know. I hate him with a passion. I, we all do. Except for the people who like him. Yeah, we all do, except for those people who don't. <laughs> Fuck them. Honestly, though. They don't deserve equal rights! <laughs> Not like the robots, which are clearly not an allegory for racism. <laughs> they have a dream. God, I want to die. <laughs> I want to die. David Cage, my story isn't about racism. Proceeds to make his story about racism. <laughs> Tara! <gasps> Take me with you. Tara, I love you. I, can't I really do. do. That, But Tara, oh no! I just... When I really need you, Vin, I know you'll be there. Well, that's true. Well, why wouldn't I? <laughs> You're my friend. Yeah. Their hearts are connecting in right. the most gay way. Thanks, Vin. He's a minor. <laughs> Actually, they might both be. I, I they, don't know. I don't, yeah, I don't know if they have, like, official ages. I can see, uh, Tara being, like, 16 or 17. I think he's, like, 18. Okay. I just... When I really... Yes, we, we were th there for that! <laughs> <laughs> I better tell Aqua. Thanks, guys! Oh, man. It's funny, he, like, just told Aqua she's awful and ran away, and now he's like, I gotta go tell her! <laughs> Like, damn, kid, make him your mind. I'm kidding. He's a teenager, he's emotional. I'm glad I just did that when there are no other dudes left. Well, now you know what tornadoes now like. Now I know what tornadoes do. Pretty sure you can also move it around, too. Oh, that'd be pretty dope. And would also make more sense instead of me just standing, <laughs> standing there, there staring awkwardly. at it. Yeah! Alright. Not that there were any enemies there, though. But still, you know, we were watching it. I was getting a feel for the move. <laughs> hey, guys. Did you guys see my awesome tornado? Did you, did you guys think I was cool? Were you impressed? He was. I know he was. And now he's dead. Yeah. You monster. Well, we can't always get Wow, look at this want. villain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, he's not Tara. <laughs> I hate these flower beds. There's like no. They're ugly. No uh, separation. Like they've got a little bit of a ledge, yeah. but like people are like me are just gonna stomp all over them. <laughs> I like the um, How... Easter rocks. <laughs> yeah, some nice pastel colors. This is like very unimaginative. I know. This is some bad. With design. like, your name is Radiant Garden. Like, and you're like um, squares, yeah. color squares. That's that's what the people want. <laughs> Well, That's I mean, maybe right? Ansem is keeping the people Man, down when I... they can't see this. <laughs> I mean, I think he is, but... I can't see. Yeah, I can totally move it. Yeah. I can totally move it. Oh, yeah. Oh, now I'm getting beat up. <laughs> Just like in real life? Just like in real life. I've never gotten beat up in real life, thank you very much. Because I don't get into fights. I fight with words. <laughs> do you? Also, my arthritis would make it really hard to punch someone, so I generally <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> you can kick them, though. I can kick them. I have steel toe boots. I have Doc Martens. Exactly. I can kick anybody. I can kick anybody I want. Exactly. Just kick them and run away. Or I stomp with their foot and pretend it was an accident. <laughs> oh, make... <laughs> sorry! I was gonna make a reference, but then you wouldn't get, because you don't play Yakuza. Well, sorry. You Bitch. fake gamer. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm so I'm excited. sorry I'm not Japanese enough. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> Three and four... Three, four, and five. Being remastered. Right? Yeah, but only in Japan right now. But oh. but Yakuza Six apparently sold super well, like for what they expected. Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, there's hope. There's, because there apparently, is three is super rare in the U. S. And like, you can't get it for like under eighty dollars. Holy shit. Yeah, and it's considered like the worst one in the series. Ah! <laughs> That's why it's in such high demand. Apparently, like, the first three hours is you taking care of an orphanage. What? <laughs> and you're, what? like, looking for children.
children? Like, oh my god. Oh, dude, like, because the main character, he's an orphan, and he's, yeah. all, about, he's all about the kids. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I haven't played any of the games. I've seen the movie, though, so, uh, even from that, I'm like, yeah, I see it. Oh, really? Yeah. Because he's taking care of a kid the whole time. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know how, like, accurate how it is, it especially is. with how much the fans hate I the I know, movie. I would imagine it's probably not very accurate. I thought it was great, but it's also directed by Mike, and he has a kick-ass sense of humor, and, like, he just does whatever the fuck he wants, so that's why I liked it. Ben! Were you able to find him? Yeah, but... He's gone. Right. Then I can't stay here. Let me go with you, Aqua. No, Ven. Do as I say and go home. <sighs> You're not my mom. Why won't you let me? I don't want to put you in harm's way. It's like they just, they're just trying to protect him by like trying to make him go back home, but it's just like, no, he, it's just You're gonna make him sad. do like the exact opposite. Yeah. Also, like the fact that she's supposed to take him home and he's just like, yeah, go. Like, Aqua, <laughs> you really, he, how many times has he told you no so far? Yeah. <laughs> like, you go. know he's not just gonna do it. Yeah. Uh, Giving up already? Come on, Ven. I thought you were stronger than that. Then you almost had him. Just try it again. Hey, wait. You're teaming up now? Yeah. Yeah, two against one. It's the only way they can beat the buff boy. <laughs> nice clouds. <laughs> They're nice and wispy. Look, he's got the I have no soul eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Ben, you see all those dents and nicks you got? Each one of those is proof you're learning. Look at how supportive they are. I know. You need to learn to let your body move you. Right? <clears throat> In your hand, take this blade. And so long as you have the makings, then through this simple act of taking, its wielder you shall one day be made. <laughs> What's that about? Who went and made you master? Being a Keyblade Master is all I've dreamed about. Well, you're not the only one. I know. You, me, and Ven all share the same dream. Things are happy. Oh, who are these assholes? Nobody good, that's for sure. Let's go beat them oh. up. Oh, shit! This yours? Oh my god! Lee. We Look at him in his khakis and his <laughs> scarf. Up, It'll only take a sec. His hair you looks so much better like this than <laughs> that long hair. <laughs> now this right here. Ta-da! What do you think? Frisbees? <laughs> Not a whole lot. No! Lee. <laughs> Got it memorized? Lee. What's your name? Lee. Oh. Ventus. I always, before okay, I Ventus, played this, play. I thought it was Leah too. Okay. Why would I want to do that? You scared of losing? Come on. He's so bouncy. Hope you're ready. <laughs> yeah, now we're talking. You're gonna be sorry. Time to fight? <laughs> Look at this fucking mullet. <laughs> there are lots of mullets in these games. I know. <laughs> Oh, I don't even get I know, to that's them. bullshit. That's yeah, bullshit. Oh, for sure I'd be able to. It's not even like you'd be using a real keyblade. No. <laughs> right. From where I stood, the only thing you drew was a big L on your forehead for loser. Oh! Man, what? 
Isn't this the part where you cheer me up or something? You're just having a bad day, or that's what you get for pulling your punches. <sighs> Some friend. Oh, you mean I was supposed to lie? Lie to fr spare your friend's feelings. <laughs> I sure hope you don't have friends like him. Uh, we're best friends! <laughs> I know your name! Guys, I know your names, we're best friends now. See, Lee, they shared a little chuckle. <laughs> exactly. They're best friends. Already? I'll see you when I see you. See, you look, after all, we're friends now. Yeah. <laughs> Get it memorized. Okay, Lee. <laughs> what is it with you and picking up stray puppies? Aizen, don't be fucking oh, rude! I everybody I meet to remember me. Fucking asshole. Yeah. Inside people's memories, I can live forever. That's all sad. I know I won't forget you. Believe me. <laughs> all the time. Okay, but that's true friendship. <laughs> yeah, it really is. <laughs> like, actually. <You're> obnoxious. <laughs> I hate his gun. <laughs> <laughs> We're looking at Pike. Well, yeah, you I just are. heard noises. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go, loser. <laughs> Must be nice. Knowing who your friends are. But <laughs> you know who your friends are. <laughs> you guys know each other's names. <laughs> Ben's a little dramatic. Uh, slightly. <laughs> Just a little. That's such an ugly keyblade. But it's called Frolic Flame. <laughs> That's a cool name, right? Yeah. Don't you want a frolic now? Yeah. Frolic time? So... Which horrible world do you want to go to? God, none of these. <laughs> none of these. I don't want to do any of these. <laughs> um. Is there any that makes more sense plot-wise to do first? Nah. Let's, uh... We... <laughs> <laughs> Look at this surfboarding idiot. Huh? What's that? Nothing good, I'm sure. Whoa! Oh god! Whoa! That's your beautiful soul! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a squid -o. Oh, I Try like squid. Do you? They're cool. They're kind of creepy. Like, giant squids are kind of creepy. Giant squids are super creepy. But they're cool! Like, do I want to fight one in a parking lot? No, <laughs> but they're pretty cool. Yeah! Colossal squids are even creepier. They're all kind of creepy, but yeah, I mean, Colossal ups the ante on the creepy. <laughs> you know what's kind of, like, so ugly it's cute? What? Cuttlefish. They're not so ugly, they're cute, they're just cute! No, they're so ugly, they're cute! No! Yeah! They're just cute. You don't know what you're talking about. They're just cute. Your opinion is always wrong. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Coming from someone who's wrong all the time. I have never been wrong a day in my You've life. You've been wrong, like, every single time. About day. what? You can't name a single like fucking everything. thing! everything! You're no, always wrong. No, no, Who do you think I am? Who do you think you are? <laughs> Who do you think I am? You are! <laughs> You're wrong, cuttlefish are just cute. No, they're so ugly, they're cute. That why are we looking at his butthole? <laughs> Trying to catch a ride, huh? We I guess it's unavoidable when we're chasing. Looking at this, like I don't know, it just made me think of Voltron. <laughs> Space, I mean. And, yeah, well, like, the, the episode where, uh, Hunk and Keith gotta get the bullshit from the giant wormy bullshit. Oh, yeah, the, uh, uh Weblum? Yeah! Um, and now I just wanna watch Voltron. <laughs> I wish I didn't. Next month. But I do. I know! I'm freaking out.
Now don't get any more ideas. These guns are locked into your genetic signature. Huh. An intruder? All right, you. Don't get any funny ideas. I know we said this before, but that guy's voice, I always hear him in, like, cartoons and shit. Yeah. But I don't know his I name. I don't know who he is, but his voice is super familiar. And it's every time it's like, oh, it's that guy. Yeah. Look him up. I am DP that shit. All right. Let's find out who he is. All right. But don't take too long, because I can't count carry this conversation by myself. So you're the intruder. I'm going as fast as my phone will fucking let me. My name is Ventus. I like how he's got a gun to him. He's like, hi, I'm Ventus! <laughs> I know. Let's try. If there was another intruder aboard, we'd have detected it. Huh? Intruder in the machinery bay. We lost control of the engines. It's some kind of monster. Now you tell me. Stay right there. I have lots of unpleasant questions to ask you. This is my fault. I have to do something. I've never heard of him. I haven't either, and he doesn't look familiar either. No. I guess he's just got one of those voices. You know him, but you don't know what he looks what? like. Yeah. You know Terra and Aqua? Now I'm like, I gotta look up everything he's been in. And it's like, he's in everything and nothing. Is that a Wayfinder? I hate it when you're like, I recognize that voice. Where are they from? And you go and look, and they're just like additional voices. On yeah, everything yeah. And you're like, oh well, fuck me. No, you need to stay here. It's too dangerous. Then you're doing that shit to Stitch that everybody does to you. <laughs> teenagers. Fucking teenagers. Fucking hypocrites. I got a high potion. Looking through this, damn, I'm learning about a lot of, um, Disney spin-offs I had no idea yeah. about. Like, uh, Cinderella 2? Like, Belle's Tales of Friendship? What? <laughs> Nobody cares about your friends, Belle. Your friends are all imaginary, Belle. <laughs> Belle's Magical World? My Magical World. Apparently he was Cogsworth. Huh. Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas. What? <laughs> Murder, she wrote. <laughs> Pocahontas. Oh shit, he was uh, Governor Radcliffe. Oh hey. Now I'm like, god damn, buddy. Oh, I guess he wasn't the original. I don't think he was the original Cogsworth, though. Oh, he's just in all the spinoffs. Yeah. He gets the made-for-TV movies. Yep. What a hack! What? <laughs> Am I right, fellas? <laughs> Alright, now I'm in the 80s shit. I don't know any oh of this. God. I gotta go. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. That's the problem with, um, IMDB. You sit there and you're like, time to go down, like... Yeah. Time to get lost in a spiral of who voice acted and what. Yep. Yeah. Let me look at this movie and see who was in that. And, oh, I don't remember this. And oh, this movie. This movie was really bad. Oh, and this movie was too. <laughs> who played that guy? Oh, let me click on this and let me just let me just see where this goes. And you know the worst part about it is that like when you go back to it, it shows you like your old like search. Oh yeah, everything is like it's all highlighted purple, and you're like, I looked at all. Of yeah, <laughs> and it's like, wow, I really am on this <laughs> site too much. <laughs> Thanks for making me feel bad, guys. Thanks, guys. Assholes. It's over. Is there anything left, even? Oh. Funky ass bitch. <laughs> I was gonna say, as you can't get him. I know. But actually, though. I got him now, it's okay. Mm, do you? I got him. Yeah. Look at me kicking his ass. I'm buff. Are you? I'm so buff. You're no Tara. I mean, no, but I'm still pretty buff. He's a buff boy. I got muscle, you just can't see him. Okay, not. <laughs> that scrawny boy. <laughs> I love Noctis. I do too. 
I was really surprised by how much I wound up liking him because I was like, whatever, he's just gonna be like some moody emo bitch. I know. Hair, and then I played it. It was like my boy. I also hate how people like, again, not that 15 is anywhere near perfect. But, like, people wouldn't even give it a chance because they're like, oh, he's just gonna be Cloud 2.0. Oh, I know! Like, they were shitting on it before the game even came out. Like, at, at least... Again, it's far from a perfect game. It has so many flaws that I could go on and on about, but it's also, like, no, there are also a lot of really fun things about it, too. Yeah. There are a lot of really good things about it, like... Specifically the bros. Uh, yeah! Their characterization is so good. I know. It's like... Honestly, if that game had one more year. Yeah, it's like they just needed more time. Which sounds ridiculous because it's like, oh yeah, it was in development for ten years, but it's also like... But they redid it. it like, they, they started redid so many so times. much stuff, they had so many changes. Fucking Nomura was doing whatever he wanted. <laughs> Pretty much. And then, yeah, like, I re remember I read one article where it was like, he was like trying to go behind, like, executives' backs yep. and do stuff. And it's like, yeah, I don't blame him if I was making something... Like, I would want it to be my way and not have executives sit there like, no, no, like, Absolutely. you can't do this. But it's also like, well, no wonder they fired, or they didn't fire him, but, like, no wonder they took him off the project. Let's be real, they fired him yeah, I mean, that. technically, it's like, it's one of those things where it's like, I, I don't really blame him for wanting it to be the way that he wanted it without some guy in a suit just telling him what to do. Yeah. But it's also like, what do you think was gonna happen? Yeah, you yeah, yeah, to them yeah. And like doing whatever you want, you know. It's like, and not shocking that way. Either, yeah, like so. if he wasn't like one of their like main dudes, he would have been gone. Oh, absolutely. But since seeing as how he does like all of their character designs yeah, and shit, yeah, like well, they weren't gonna get rid of him. But it's still fucking like, Kingdom Hearts, one of their biggest franchises. Uh, yeah, no. no way in hell. But then I also feel bad because I feel like people are just shitting on Tabata all the time for shit that's not his fault. I know. It's like he just got handed this mess and he had to work with it. Like, don't blame yeah, him Yeah, and for the only everything. reason he got it was because he's good with time management. Yeah, and they needed the game to come out. And, like, Nomura, who's like, mm, it'll be ready in another ten years. Yeah, like, I love Nomura, but he is, he's the epitome of, like, creativity is, like, the priority, nothing else. Yeah, you know, yeah, like, it takes whatever time it takes. Yeah, I'm gonna what do whatever like, I want. You're gonna get what you get. Like, yeah. deal with it. Yeah. <laughs> and it's like, we do need more people like that. Totally. But he does I mean, need to be reined in. Absolutely. No, I totally agree. Um, it's one of those things where it's like, you can't just say, like, everything about this developer is bad. Or, right. like, all the choices he made were bad. It's like, no, they both have their strengths and weaknesses. Talking specifically about Nomura and Tabata. Right, right. Um... Yeah, so it's like, I don't know. Again, people want to, like, shit on one or the other when it's like they both, like, contributed good things to the game. They both contributed yeah. things that you probably don't like. Well, it's so. also like, I always think of, um, there's something like, I don't remember what video it is, but, like, Pat was talking about, like, how normally with games, it's like, coming out and they're bad, you blame a team. Like, it's yeah, a, clearly yeah. a team effort. But then it's like David Cage... You can, like, blame specifically David Cage. Yeah, because you know that was all David. Right. Like, you know like, it was him. There's certain times where it's like, no, this was all this person. Yeah. And it just depends on, on the studio, on the developer. Like, it depends on a lot. Right. But, yeah, something like that. It's like, no, you know David is like, this is my Like, person. he's like the gifted child. Yeah. Sony. No. And it's like, I know that, like, Sony is so obsessed with having, like, an author, you know? Yeah, yeah. With their games to be, like, mature and shit, but it's like... Of, like, you're doing it the wrong fucking way. Yeah. Like, you need to let him go, you know? Like, yeah. stop trying to cling on to this. I know The you fact that he makes female employees call him daddy... It's disgusting. Yeah. It's disgusting. And, like, that, the fact that he's been getting away with it for as long as he has. It's awful. I got, like, you want to talk about shit that needs to change in the gaming industry? That's it, yeah. you know? Um, but yeah, no, I wish Sony would just, like, let it go. I feel like at this point, they're trying to push it because it's like, they know he's dying and dragging them down with him, and it's like they're still trying to make money off of it yeah. while they can. And it's like, like, with how much money they threw into Detroit, I 100% get why they're still doing that. Yeah, but it's also like... You fuckers know! Yeah, it's like he's a piece of shit. Like, let it go. Aww. I don't know how you did it, but you won't get away again. <laughs> you haven't fooled me. You can bat your eyes all you want at the Grand Councilwoman, so she'll reconsider your sentence. 
But I see you for what you really are. An abomination that's only instinct is to destroy everything it touches. He just wants that was so emotional. I'm sad. Honestly, it was more emotional than Detroit. It really <laughs> was. I haven't even played the game yet, and I can guarantee you. Yes. <laughs> more like watched Matt. And Pat play I was it. gonna say there ain't no way I'm playing Matt, that. Matt, Pat, and Wooly. I can't leave Wooly out. I'm always just so used to it being like Matt, Matt and Pat. Yeah. God. Yeah. I cannot wait for that LP. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I, I, on the one hand, I'm like, I kind of want to watch, like, Omicron again, just in uh, preparation. <laughs> I fucking love Omicron. <laughs> like, that's, like, that's one of their best. Oh, it's God. one of their best. Just, like, the fact that they, like, completely lose their shit. I also, what was I watching? I don't remember if it was, uh... I think it was Homecoming when they were playing that game and near the end of it, like, Matt just stops talking. Yeah, he's yeah, so yeah. Mad. <laughs> it kills me every time. Yeah, the final episode oh where, God. like, Matt's like, you're so mad. I know, he's like, say something, and Matt's like, I don't wanna. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but that was also you during Heavy Rain. <laughs> I, oh, it totally was. Like, that's why I think it's so funny, because I'm like, I understand. I know. And that was, like, my pure joy was how mad he got. <laughs> I was so mad. But it's funny because I think, like, the maddest I got with all the games we played was, um, Horizon Zero Dawn. Yeah, for understandable reasons, I think. No, I'm so close. I'll just leave it. I'm so close to having that level up. <laughs> to level two. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> Shut up. I didn't say anything. You were laughing at me. I would never. Let me fucking live, Jocelyn. Why are you yelling at me? That's racist. <laughs> Guys, I'm being abused. Video games are the only source of enjoyment in my life and you can fuck right off. <laughs> they really are. <laughs> they're, they're my only way of making fake friends. They're my pride and joy, but not really. Like, fuck video games, but also, like, am I gonna waste Oh, I thought you were gonna say, but fuck video no, games. No! No! And I was like, mm. No! <laughs> like, I will bitch all day, every day about everything that needs to change in the industry while also being like, mm, still gonna waste all my time playing them, yep, though. Yep, yep, same. I'm, I always hate that where I'm like, oh, I really don't want to spend my money on this. But, oh god, it looks so but, oh, good. God, like, oh Ubisoft, god, I have to. Anything with Ubisoft and their fucking season pass is like, I really want the season five or season pass for uh, Far Cry Five. But I'm also like, but it's Ubisoft. Are they? Are there like DLCs and shit for Far Cry Five? Yeah, it's got thirty dollars for. I thought it was only twenty. But I'm like, I don't want to pay thirty dollars because I just redid my. PS Plus subscription. Oh, yeah. Um, so there's three story DLCs, and they're totally random. Like, one is, like, Vietnam. One is... Vietnam? Yeah. What? Yeah. Another one is, um, Zombies. And the other one is Martians. That's okay. I kind of like that they're just, like, doing yeah. whatever I think it. I think it is. They were written by... I love Cyclone. <laughs> um, the dudes who did, uh, Blood Dragon. Oh, oh, it's gonna be so I don't fun. know, like, I just saw, like, a trailer. It barely showed anything for the Vietnam one. And it looked oh, kind of serious, but I don't know. I, I, it's, like, cause Far Cry does get serious sometimes, but it's also always cut with humor. Right. So, so like, um, you get those three, and then you get, um, Far Cry 3 for free. That's pretty cool. Yeah. But I'm like, $30, I just paid 60 yeah. And it's yeah. Ubisoft, so I don't want to give them money Ubisoft. because they're so bad with season passes. Yeah. I hate that. It's like, I want the content, but I'm also like, this is fucking rip off. Yeah. Like, honestly, the only season pass where I had, like, zero guilt for it was for Uncharted 4. Yeah. Because, like, Naughty Dog gives you the whole game. They give you enough con- it doesn't feel just like- a cash grab, yeah. like, we released an incomplete game and we're gonna make you finish it with DLC. Like, it was $20, I got the DLC for free, which turned into the $40 Lost Legacy, yeah, yeah, for yeah. anyone who doesn't know. Um, you got, like, a bunch of, like, free boosters and, like, 
uh, money for like the multiplayer, and I knew I was gonna play it, so I had no yeah, problem yeah. with that. So like spending twenty dollars on that, which is basically five dollars for multiplayer, fifteen dollars for the DLC, I was fine with that. Yeah, it's not a huge deal. And like I said, like they give you the whole game. It wasn't like an Ubisoft game where like half the missions are DLC. Yeah, yeah. You know, so that was the only time I was like, didn't even hesitate to buy it. Mm -hmm. I get it's like I don't mind paying for DLCs when it's not just like shit that should have been right, in the game. right. And it's like you know with The Last of Us Left Behind. That is totally unnecessary to the story. Absolutely. So that's why it's okay as DLC. Yeah. And it also, I felt like it had a lot of um, replayability. Right. Um, it just wasn't like something that's like clearly needed to be in the story for you to understand it. It exactly. was like a little extra bonus. Yeah. I don't know. It was just like, I'm not necessarily against DLC. But I'm, I'm also not, not for it. Yeah. No, I totally agree. I, I don't minds DLC when again it is just like extra bonus content for people who want more or like or you know what else since I've been playing Second Son uh First Light I First felt like Light. that was a good DLC too yeah. because again they have a bunch of like um it was uh like challenges and things that you yeah. can go back and do plus you get a story portion like I really like that DLC yeah I again, love that DLC it was not necessary favorite. for you to understand the main story but it was like a really nice added thing to yeah. play. Yeah, and, like, honestly, like, the, um, like, the arena fights where you can just do them. Yeah, yeah. Those are actually a lot of fun, yeah, and I remember, so like, fun. <laughs> trying to get, like, a high score and stuff. Yeah. That's actually why, when I started replaying it, I was like, I kind of just want to play the DLC and, like, mess around in the arena. Yeah.